Hi, my name's Russ Crowley and I'm the creator of the one click book creation software. I've been a word user for about 20 years and I've self-published seven of my own books. And last year I was looking at a way that I could come up and use my knowledge of word to help people write their books in both Kindle and especially on the print books, because with Word it is actually quite difficult, as I'm sure you've experienced if you try to do it yourself. Now the book that I wrote to accompany the application was called How to Publish Your Book on CreateSpace and Kindle, and this is available on CreateSpace, on Amazon, and also on the Kindle platform. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how I created the outline for this using my template. Now as you can see it's 180 pages in size. And it's all fully illustrated and detailed. I'm just going to close that down now and I'm going to go to the desktop. And what I'd like you to do is keep an eye on the clock in, in the top right hand corner. Because it says now approaching the 30 seconds. So when it hits 30 seconds I'll start. So there we go. It's just hit 30 seconds. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to navigate to and find where I put my record for the book, my delimited file, and then I'm going to load that information, and the book size is 8 by 10. This template actually has 18 trim sizes. The number of pages is 180, but I'll leave that there. One inch margin all around, and I'll put in, let's say, 20 chapters. Whoops, better use a zero and not a, an O, and then I'll leave all the front matter and the rear matter as it is, and I'll click on Create Book. And there we go, in the background, and there we are. The file is now saving, and I'll save that to my desktop. And there we go, so that was under 45 seconds to create this professional book. Now, it's not going to be exactly how I want it, because, like, for example, my published by gets pushed down here, but I can just quickly remedy that. And that brings that up nicely, so I've got my perfectly laid out title page and my copyright page then I come down to testimonials dedication table of contents which seeing as I created 20 chapters then it's given me those those here and it goes down to heading two thus far and then we have abbreviations index of figures index of tables etc then we have a blank page which we need that because with word you can't start deleting blank pages when you have what they call sections until your book is, is practically finished because you don't know how the pagination is going to lie. And then on chapter one, I always make you have to have a chapter one when you create a new book because this explains about the styles that I use in my template and all the styles which I use are on my main styles menu here. So, for example, if you wanted to turn this one into a heading one on the same page, then you could do it that way, like that. If you wanted actually on a new page, another one and another one and another one and if you look down on the navigation pane it's all creating them nicely if let's say for example i wanted to in introduce some body text let's say i want 10 paragraphs with 10 sentences then i can do it that way and then if i wanted if i could spell that is if i wanted a heading oh look at that it's late it's been a long day and I can have a heading two, and then I can come down a paragraph, have a heading three, come down a paragraph, have a heading four. And as you can see in the navigation pane on the left hand side, it's creating the structure quite nicely. So after heading four, if I have a heading three, I can do it that way. Now I'm not even using the mouse at this stage, I'm using the keyboard. But because I'm recording a video and I'm, and I'm talking to you and telling you what I'm doing, I'm not doing it as quickly as I would normally do it. But if I, let's say, let, for example, I did it like this. So we have a heading two, then we have a, then we have a heading three, then a heading two, then a heading two. Let's say we have another heading one, then a heading two, then a heading three, then a heading that's heading three let's put it in as a heading four and if i click on update toc and then go up to my table of contents we can see that this has created the structure but it's only going down to heading level two and it's all fully clickable and takes us through the document if we want to 
look at the margins that we have in the document or the paper or the layer, then we can use the buttons on the Your Book menu. I've only included the main functional item that you actually need for creating your book. You don't need things like Mail Merge for when you're creating a book. So I've got rid of it. I've just put the essential buttons in here. And as you can see, when we click on Document Properties and we look at the Summary tab, here's all my book information. So let's say I want to change Kindle to KDP. Then I click on OK. Now there's two places in the document we'll find this. One is here. So I update the field. And the other one's here where I update the field. So you don't have to mess with this information in the document and risk having errors. So I can do it that way, or I can also do it. There's another way I can do it, but I'll show you that in the training anyway. So there we go. And we'll come down to the table of contents, like I say. So if I now want to, to get rid of all these ones, which I've just created, let's do it again. Look, let me go. Okay. Don't you just hate it when that happens? So there we go. Let me get rid of of those chapters. Then I click on update TOC and there it is back to normal. That's all rough and ready what I've done here because I'm doing it for the video but obviously if I was doing this professionally then this would all be looking far, far better, and I would be doing it with a with slightly more panache, let's say. So you can update the table that way. And there you go. That's how the one-click book creation professional template works. There's a lot more to it. There's, there's video training as well. There's six hours of video training. It shows exactly how I publish the book. I hope you like what you see. Thanks very much.